Now that we know what's on the stream page, the title, upcoming events, upcoming assignments and their due dates, as well as all the announcements and assignment notifications, let's talk a little bit more specifically about managing that stream. First things first, you'll notice at the top it says, share something with your class. So, I am going to share something with Mr. Moore's test class, or if I wanted to share it with multiple classes, I could check all boxes. I also want to share with all students. Now, if I had students that populated the class, I could choose specific students to talk to. But as a general rule, emailing specific students is a good idea unless it's at younger grades where this is your framework for getting in touch with parents and students directly. So what do I want to share with the class? We are off to a great start. Take a look for new assignments posted regularly. All right. I can even add attachments to this, and those could be from a Google Drive, from a link, from a file, or from a YouTube. But we'll get back to that in a bit. Additionally, I can post it right now, or I can even schedule a post to happen a little bit later, or if I'm not ready, save it as a draft. I'm going to go ahead and post it right now. You will notice it stays right here at the top of the screen. But if I'm planning ahead for my class, I may not want this at the top of the screen. So what I can do is I can actually take different pieces and move them. So in this case, welcome ladies and gentlemen, that needs to be at the top. So let's move that one to the top. And there we go. It's been moved to the top of the stream. I can also delete a post if I think it's unnecessary, or I can copy the link to that post so that if I wish to use it in an email, or if I've misspelled something or forgotten a period, I can add it in. So, that's one component. And you'll notice I have allowed the class to comment so they're allowed to put their posts right here and send it in. Or even I could follow it up myself. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen. This is going to be a great year. So in this case, the stream works very much like Facebook, like many social media platforms. And how much you allow students onto this social media platform was set over here in those settings on what they're allowed to do. So, just remember that can be set, reset, or adjusted at any point. You'll also notice it's giving me an update on notifying me that the stream has been updated so I can go see it. Additionally, let's see what else we can do. Down here we have an assignment that was posted. And that assignment has all the components in it. And again, if I want to see the details, I can go to the instructions. When I want to go back, back to my classroom. Now, that's the stream. You'll notice, though, that the stream can get fairly crowded fairly quickly. And important things can be moved down the stream, especially depending on who's allowed to comment. So, in this case, this works out fairly well, but maybe some organizational ideas might be in order. So, before we move on with that, let's go take a look at classwork.